Hello, <laughs> magical and non-magical friends. Welcome back to our channel. We're back at Samantha's place because we have a new magical unboxing for you guys. Mist and Magic box. Mm. So this box, from my understanding, isn't specifically Harry Potter themed. It's almost as if this company created their own magical world mm. and like their own sort of Diagon Alley. Huh. Yeah, that's a good idea. But this came from France. You could get it in English or in French. So the box says Castle Wind, the best magical street in Edinburgh. 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 <laughs> Edinburgh. <laughs> I'll just say every way possible. <laughs> Any way that you can pronounce that. But Norland's Apothecary, Sweets and Tricks, hmm. Wandmaker's Shop, The Occult Emporium, Enchanted Parchments, Souvenir Shop, Ortelius Maps, and what's that one? Storm Crows Potions and Elixirs. Mm. Elixirs. So then elixirs. it just <laughs> then it just says magical <laughs> shop. Shut up. Let's see what elixirs we'll find in here. <laughs> so I can't read or write, but <laughs> yeah. So I'm really actually excited about this. I don't believe this was a subscription box. I think it was a one-off. You could just go and buy the box. I mean, surprise if I get charged for another one later on, but. I've been so excited to open this and see what kind of magical treasures we have in here. Mm, okay. I shouldn't have wore this wool hat, man. It's like sweaty. It's kind of not sweaty. It's because I'm wearing this hat is what I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> We're wearing our Disney princesses shirts today. They have nothing yeah. to do with Harry Potter, but she came here wearing hers. So I was like, I'll wear mine too. Boop. There's some magic in the cat up here. <laughs> I'm going to open this up and we're going to see what kind of magical treasures we got in here. So let's do a sneak peek. What do we got? Yeah, it's purple. Purple tissue paper with it's some got the little squigglies. Little squigglies. Yeah, this looks so cool. This looks pretty magical. I guess I'm gonna go for this black box that's chilling here. It says a venom antidote for the most potent and deadly serpentine bee. Mm. That's pretty cool. Like Nagini. Like Nagini. Jesus. <gasps> what? <laughs> that's the same bottle as our love potion. Anti-venom serum. That's Dope. It's empty, but it's really cool. Hold it up. So it comes in like this really nice, like felty, yeah, not felt, dope. but like satin almost. And it's padded. This serum this is, nice. is in gas form. One breath is enough in most. I can't tell because it's like old English writing. Do not exceed three or it can become lethal. So you breathe it in. Because it's a gas. Yeah. That's awesome. That's so cool. And I was like, it's empty. It is glass. It's the same exact bottle as the love potion. Yeah, it is that same shape bottle. That's really cool. That's so fun and like different because I'm like, why is it empty? But it's in gas form, get it? <laughs> That's really cool. And this box is dope. This is pretty classy. Yeah, that is dope. Dope. So let's go with this thing. But it's a box. Norland's Apothecary Potions Kit, Castle Wind, Edinburgh, Scotland. In the front. So Number 178. Five, three, so it's got a number on it. Oh my god, there's little things inside of it. Guys, it's a little potions kit! Stop it! Stop. Oh my god, so there's a bunch of little things in here. This said dry, says dried lavender buds. Yeah, I can smell it. There's lavender in there. Mm, yep, it's cute, little. And then up here, it's got dried lavender buds, five grams with like a rune. That's pretty cool. This is pretty dope, guys. Little bottles. Little baby bottles. This one says sleeping drought base formula number 7132. Duh. Oh. Okay, that one flying. That we'll show that one later. Um and then this one says crystallized oh. dragon's blood. Uh, what? It's got like a a shiny, it's like not wax. It's um, it's something hard <laughs> and black. Little labels are dope. Yeah, this is cute. Cockatrice eggs. It's a cockatrice. What the hell is a cockatrice? These <laughs> enchanted eggs will keep their properties and stay fresh for years. Let's see what it looks like. Reduce eggshells to thin powder before adding it to pour potions. Is there? <laughs> Stop! They're oh like little plastic God. eggs. <laughs> That's too funny. That's cute. 
little baby plastic eggs in this yep. little box. So it's a little box with these little plastic eggs that they spray painted a little bit of like gold on. And or black. Let me put these little guys in here. There's one more ingredient for this little box. The potion bottle that you put it in or no? No, gold butcher's broom leaves. Oh, cool. Ah, so they're like spray painted little gold leaves. So little potion cool ingredients. Bottle. This is the cutest little potions kit. Yeah, that is cool. Ah, I love it. Yeah, that's so cute. Do you, you want me to do this one? Because yeah. you're pointing at it. Yep. So this one's in like a red sack. Looks fancy. Souvenir shop. So this is from the souvenir shop. One of the little magical shops. <laughs> okay, so it's wrapped on something else inside this cute little situation. They did a lot of like wrapping so that things would be like good to go. Oh my god, it's gonna be a mug. Uh, Souvenir shop mug. You see this? <laughs> I like cups. Oh, it's oh, like their own little Diagon Alley! So Stop! That's cool. So it's got all the names of their little shops for their um, road. What was the road name? Do we remember? Earth. Castle Wind. Little Castle Wind in Edinburgh. It's like Slytherin-ish style. Yeah, it's got snakes. Green and black. That's really cute, guys. A mug with their own little Castle Wind alley, road, lane. And that's cool. And it came from the souvenir shop. That's really cute because, you know, when you go souvenir shopping, there's always mugs with stuff on it, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, that one you want me to do next? Yeah, so it's type of, it's probably some type of poster. Might be some sort of print. I like don't want to ruin the twine, even though it's just there. I think you have to ruin it. <laughs> Sweets and tricks, it's like their candy. Yeah. Their flying there's, cupcake owl. There's more than one. Oh, cool. So it's like um like a street poster that you'd see an advertisement for their Sweets and Tricks shop. Which is kind of like um, sweets, which Pumpkin would be pasty. honey dukes, and then tricks is like Instead of Measles. a chocolate frog, they did a chocolate lizard. Yeah, little chocolate lizard. Whoa. Oh, that's cute. What does that say? Dragon eggs? So like different flavored little dragon eggs. Yeah. That's cute. What's the next one? What's the next one? So excited. What? Constellations of the Northern Sky. Look at the shininess. Yes, is this your inner Niffler getting cool. pumped? Oh, it's like the sort of Gryffindor. Almost. But look, it's like it's like a zodiac, but magical creatures. Pretty cool. April to May. It looks like a buckbeak and a serious black a kelpie. <laughs> They're very Harry Potter-esque. It's a dire wolf. What's yours? But that's a thirteenth. So this one here. Oh, so you're the manticore. What's the manticore? The manticore. Uh, I think that's yeah, that guy story? over there. The it's like a bat type no, thing. it's like a flying lion thing. Oh. So hardworking, stubborn, ambitions, ambitious, and straightforward. I am not stubborn. Yeah, you are. Not really. We're both pretty stubborn. I've met more stubborn people. No, yeah, in my okay, life. that's true. <laughs> so which one? Where's mine? Wait, I gotta find mine. June twenty seventh to August fifth. That's the sea serpent. Ooh. Distant, powerful, determined, and creative. That's all true. Mm. Mm, yeah. Yeah, but you I are slack off a little bit. Ambitious, not so much. Yeah. Straightforward, not so much. Yeah, I feel like mine wasn't right. Yeah, they didn't get you to a T on that one. Oh, what? Oh. And then this one is the Ashhorn Wand. That's cool. Oh, looking. The bottom of that. <laughs> the These bottom, are really cool. The bottom of that wand is pretty dope. It's got like all the, it's, it's got like so runes nice. and stuff about it, all about it. These are what dope, and it's from. on hard like cardstock. It's not like cheesy paper. Right. So those you are wicked cool. Them. They have like what's this? It's what crystallized the dragon made out. blood. Yeah, and it's like probably made out of this phoenix feathers. Yeah. What? Yo, that's dope, guys. So I wonder if that's like a special wand in their wizarding world. This is the really Elder cute. Wand. Because, like, you know, you think about, like, the canon material of Harry Potter, but then there's, like, all the, like, fan fiction that's out there about it. So these guys, like, kind of made their own little magical world, and that's really precious. Right. So she's passing me the next thing. Miss Magic, creating magic since 2015. What? They've been around for five years? Magical. This was the first time I ever heard about them. Shop. Someone on, um, I'm in a Facebook group where people just, there's a whole, everybody that's into Wizarding World crates or boxes, they, they post in there. And someone posted that they got the Mr. Magic box. So mm. I was like, I'm going to check it out. Divination. Yeah. So it looks like we got a couple of little things here. Divination. So it's just a little a notebook. notebook. 
but it's like a little divination book. Mm -hmm. That's cute. There's a little notepad here. Oh, it's like a to-do list. That's cute. So it's got a little owl and a magic wand. A little banner for you to write whatever you want up there, like to do, or you better right. effing do this or I'm going to punch you in the mouth. Mm -hmm. I'm just kidding. And then there's a couple other little things. There's some with a wax seal. I love wax seals. All of them that last. <laughs> this also says souvenir shop. Oh, you know what this is going to be? Think souvenir shop and then you see these cards. What do you think it's going to be? Because I, I totally have a guess. What do you get at a souvenir shop when you go souvenir shopping and there's like cards? Uh, postcards? Yeah, that's my guess. So it's got a phoenix. Yep, they are postcards. This is oh, so that cool. Looks like liquid luckish. Yeah, this is called Essence of Euphoria. Mm. What? This one says ensnaring ivy. <laughs> so those are cool little postcards with magical things on them that you could get in this little alley. That's dope, bro. This is a pretty cool box, man. Yeah. And I also like like it's not like licensed legit Harry Potter. Like, don't get me wrong. I love Harry Potter stuff. This is like somebody who's like, cool. I love the wizarding world so much that I'm gonna make up my own story in my brain and be part of it in like some other remote town. Right. This is where those witches and wizards of that magical community would go. Right. Because I th would it say Scotland? That's pretty cool though. Okay, so there's another thing here that says Winterdale University of Magic hmm. with a wax seal. Winterdale, that must be the name of their school, huh? <gasps> Hogwarts. Are you effing kidding me? Ooh. It's like a whole unfolding, a supply list. Oh, yeah, it's like your school letter. It's my letter to Winterdale. Guys, this is way too just cool. Just makes me think of Winterfell <laughs> every time yeah. I say that. So it tells you all the stuff that you need, books, a wand, tarot, or oracle cards for divination. And then what's over here? What's over here? There's more. There's tons of. It's a map. It's a map. Of a, it's a map of Scotland. Oh, I thought it was going to be. And it's got the railways and the ferry so that you know how to get to the school. That's and cool. Winterdale's way up here. Shut up. This is so cool. <laughs> oh, man. I need to display this like really legit somewhere. And then you got a little train ticket oh. down here. This is fancy and cool. There's two. Sincerely, Stephen Anderson. Steven Anderson. Director of Administration. So you have a train ticket and a ferry ticket to get to the school. What? God, I really wish there was like. But this is super cool, dude. I like this a lot. Yes, it's cool. Castle wands. Letter writing scent. Enchanted part set. Uh, set. Parchment. Oh, cute. So it's stationary. And it's got its own little stamp. Shut up. It's got its own little magical stamps in here. This is so cool. Like, we're going back to school, so we had to go there and get, like, it's got Older. envelopes. <laughs> Almost like a Canadian accent. Canadian. <laughs> Order. With paper. Sorry, guys. I'm like holding it to us and not even showing you guys. Letter this is really cute. Set. Yeah. It's a little stationary set for when I go to school and then I could send you a letter, sister, because I don't know if you got your letter to Winterdale. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm guessing this is probably the cheat sheet then because there's nothing else in the box. So this is pretty, pretty intense. Both sided. It's pretty thick good paper too well yeah when you spend a hundred dollars on a box they get put the i don't know if it was a hundred i can't look it up right now but it was a cool box this is a wicked cool box your potion just... isn't like turn that back over your potion isn't covered in wax like that no it's not but they may have done some differently or they ran mm. out of wax she's like mm, uh, i want my money back <laughs> no. i'm just kidding Real quick to just go through this, there's a good chunk of items that were in here. We had the letter to Winterdale with the tickets and like a map and stuff. There was the poster of the wand that we got. There was the serum, the venom, venom antidote. That's a gas little potion replica. Then there was the little potions kit. That's the cutest freaking thing. Then there was a map of, it's like astrology, magical mm -hmm. astrology with the night sky. There was the poster of the sweets and tricks shop the other side we have the divination notebook the little um stationary set thank you i just spaced out the little notepad that came in it that you could write to-do lists and things on and then the mug that came from the souvenir shop as well as the postcards that came from the souvenir shop so in i'm not going to read this whole thing to you guys obviously but it's just so cute that you got something from each one of the little stores yeah you know like on their street 
Stop, this is way too cute. I really like this. And then this way, we are sorry to announce that we were not able to include the Phoenix Wax Seals in this stationary set. They have unfortunately been jinxed by mistake to make any envelope invisible once stuck on it, which is quite unfortunate. We were not able to reverse the jinx in time to ship the boxes, so please accept our apologies for this. It's a wax seal though. The yeah, on the stationary. So uh, I'm guessing this, that. yeah. This must have had some sort of wax seal. So That's okay. It's so, yeah, it's so really cute. Yeah, so this was awesome. I'm so glad I did this. And then it's got all their socials on the back, and I'll leave those links down below if anyone mm -hmm. wants to check these guys out. This was really cool. I'm not disappointed. I love magical things, and this was really creative for them to make up their own little cute magical world mm -hmm. or magical Diagon Alley, their own Diagon Alley that was Castle Wind. <clears throat> I feel like you're jealous about this little potion kit. Mm, it's pretty cool. <laughs> And I like the potion kit and I like the gas serum. Yeah. And the mug. The mug's cool. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you do the like, subscribe, and share thing for us, please. That would be super awesome. And we hope that you join us next time for whatever magical or non-magical unboxing or adventure that we have for you. Let me find my wand. <laughs> <laughs> so thanks again for watching. We are the Half-Blood Half Hufflepuff, Hufflepuff Sisters. sisters.